What is happening, everybody? I hope you are having a fantastic week. Um, today we will be looking at another video of Iron Man 3, the official game for the iPad or Android devices. So, um, we are going to be looking at the armor called Mark 17 Heartbreaker. So, this is a red, gold, and silver armor. As you can see, it looks pretty detailed compared to any of the last three four armors we've seen and this armor has that big center circle bright thing that looks like I don't know I think I've seen that in a lot of games actually so um, that design is pretty cool as you can see there are a lot of detail in this uh, armor on the back actually if we get a chance to look at the back but we're gonna look at the front first and as you can see, it's entirely gold a bit, and there are straps or bars of silver, I believe, at the top shoulders. Now, on the back, as you can see, there are like air, air things. Basically, it looks like there's some sort of, something that comes out of it. But it is a little pixelated as you look into it, but it's not that bad. So, this is the Mark 17 Heartbreaker. Now let's look a bit at the description. What it says is a heavily armored suit with extra firepower. This armor is perfect against enemies that need something extra to bring them down. So that is the Mark 17 Heartbreaker. Why is it called the Heartbreaker? I'm not really sure, but let's dive into beginning the game. So we have a new mission and I think we have a new stage coming up. So as you can see we're uh, near the a bay or something, a harbor or something. And we are flying under these things. And the sun is a bit red, the sky is blue and you see a lot of water. Now this is after um, after you beat a certain amount of bosses, you get to experience these new stages. And these stages are harder in a way, I guess. Ouch. So you have these things flying around now out of nowhere accidentally. Actually, I guess they're kind of like the airplanes except you don't get to see them off in a distance. The enemies are still similar. Um, there is the same flying things. But you do see the ocean and there are still rockets. Now we are in the city in the underground uh, subway. Wow, whoa. That was difficult. And planes are still coming out of nowhere. Um, and missiles. Surprisingly, we're in the city and you still see missiles and planes and these weird things. If we take a look at the uh, streets, we actually don't see any humans. We see cars, uh, we see trucks and other things, but we don't see any human. And these plane just comes out of nowhere and does all these dodge and kind of things. I'm surprised it didn't hit anything. But some of the buildings are on fire. Now it gets more intense uh, in this kind of city area. And there is a plane coming out of nowhere. And you have all these trucks moving around. Surprisingly, there are nobody. Actually, and we have the fusion charge. So fusion charge is probably one of the coolest moves in the game, I'd say. So, as you can see, there were trucks just moments ago. And there's literally no one on the streets. And this is the... Frost uh, 
I think it's a Frost Charge Super. And this is a Frost Charge Armor if I haven't mentioned it before. Basically, if you're going through the line of Frost Charge, this is one of the armors you will get. Now we're at about 1% health. I think we're gonna be... Okay, missiles are hitting the buildings. Oh, wow, the building just... Oh. Okay, so... The building blew up, and so did we. Anyways, thank you for watching. I hope to see you in the next video. See ya.